Hey, what's up? I have Manchado here. Hi. So today's snack, I didn't get anything fancy. We just got some cream-filled croissants from the bodega. Seven days, and Manchado's a big fan of these. Now, have you ever had the double that has strawberry jam along with the vanilla filling? Honestly, I haven't. Uh, I'm Why don't very... you open that bad boy up and, and let me know how it is. I'm very excited. Yeah. Um, Deli food is honestly the best. Yeah. Um, this is why you love America, right? America's great. You know, it has a lot of the things that have sugar and made out of flour. <laughs> good, right? I and mean, it's so good. Yeah. So <laughs> you're from Colombia originally. You've been here, what, four years? Yeah. What do you miss about Colombia? Like, besides uh, mom? Besides mom, I think people are just nicer. Like, I feel, I don't know, even friendships in America. I feel like Americans are very... Like, I feel like even if you create, like, deep connections with Americans, like, I'm going to take never this away from you because you're just going to crackle it, and <laughs> it's going to be a crackling noise. Crackling it. noise. You don't like the show Narcos. Oh, no. And you get tired of that. No, yeah. I hate it because I feel like it just purposely is this, like, negative stereotype that, like, Colombia is all about, like, cocaine and, like, drug trafficking, which is not true. Mm -hmm. I was always, like, very obsessed with, like, American culture and stuff, and I... I started writing as like a way to like not have to like have like my parents like understand what I was like trying to say but also like it was kind of like a refuge for me to like it was be, like a code, code yeah language. like a code language even though like everyone in my school spoke it and stuff but yeah it's still like the fact that my like my parents didn't understand it and like I don't know it was there's so there Is was it some... weird that I like chewing on this while you're doing no. this really serious no that's perfect that. yeah, I've definitely grown out of that but I mean, so you want to do some Spanish language music yeah I mean I already have like song like I've written so many songs now mm -hmm. in Spanish and yeah like even like my latest song like free as fire like I have a Spanish version of it yeah speaking of free as fire you just uh, put out a, a video for that you had a little party here in Brooklyn to, to show to release it so tell me about that song and the video that you made to go along with it. I wrote it like two years ago after like a terrible day. Like I, I not even a terrible day. Like, it was just like a bad season for me. Like I just read like my last video and like I felt like everything was just like not going right. All the people that I have in the song are people that kind of like met along my journey of like coming to New York. Yeah, you have like these different characters going along. Yeah, with yeah. The so it, even, not even in the video. The song in itself is kind of like this like, um, reunion of like a my this like whole moment of like my first two years coming to new york so in addition to music and dance you also do a lot of stuff in the fashion world uh first of all congrats on your converse ad thank you yeah <laughs> and, and you actually do like converse you own, I, yeah. yeah i mean i usually don't wear converse as much because i always have to like dance and like be out there mm -hmm. so it's like converse are usually like i mean they're so they're, if you could partner with converse to make a dance shoe, a dance shoe yeah look i'm here <laughs> hit me up you also you paint on clothes, clothes right so if i have a pair of jeans i can just bring them to you yeah and for a fee you can yeah. do a design or whatever right? exactly it all started because i had no money yeah and i was like i, I had no money for clothes and i was like what can i do to like make this look pop yeah. And I was like, I just had paint. Mm -hmm. Like, I had paint, and I was like, I'm just, like, I started painting my own clothes. I like dragons. I like to look at a lot of, like, Japanese art. So I, like, I would just look up, like, Japanese art and, like, mm -hmm. <laughs> look at, like, tigers and dragons. Mm -hmm. And I was like, and I just kept doing it. Thank you so much for coming by and being no. on the show. Thank you for having me. See ya. I am free as my